Omaha, Nebraska. What do y'all think? <laughs> uh, so good to go go to a new place to play, but uh, never really worry about the locations. Worry about getting ready for uh, Wisconsin. That's the only thing on their minds right now. Yeah, um, I was a little surprised by 16, but I mean, it's done now. I mean, the year we get the tournament, we just gonna try to make a run. I'm, I'm, I'm happy that we get this opportunity and. Never been in Nebraska, but you know, I heard there's nothing but cornfields out there, so we'll see. <laughs> Is there any disappointment about being a 16 seed? Does that maybe create any like uh, motivation to kind of come out and prove something at all? It creates a lot of fire. Yeah, it creates a lot of fire inside because they they really didn't even acknowledge us at all as far as uh, us having a chance against Wisconsin. So uh, we definitely feel a little bit extra motivation and a little bit uh, more fire inside. Talk about this Wisconsin team a little bit. I'm, I'm assuming you guys at least watched them on TV throughout the year just because of their resume and what they've done on the floor. Uh, clearly a very good basketball team. What have you seen from them that you could think about now going, eh, that's pretty good. Warren. Well, yeah, we just watched our championship game against Michigan State right before the selection show. But um, the team that makes very few mistakes, they, uh, they just had a game where they only had five fouls the whole game. So yeah, they're not a team that's going to give you anything. So we got we to gotta make sure we go in their discipline. And uh, if we do that, we'll be fine. Well, when I watch them, um, I think the thing is we can we can beat them in transition. We can beat them down the floor because they have a really good half court defense and they uh, help a lot and they, they cover each other a lot. So I think if we can just get out and transition, get stopped, get out and transition, and get some easy buckets and some easy and some open looks, um, I think it'll definitely be a lot of things. How similar do you think they played to last year's UVA team? Uh, I think I think they uh, they looked similarly on defense. Uh, Regarding that they don't really foul much or give you much on defense, but offensively they're a little bit better uh, shooting the ball. The five men can handle the ball, and you can do some things. He's a player. Player of the year. I don't know if he actually got it, but uh, he's a, he's a good player. So they, they have some. They have about five players out there who can shoot the ball at the same time. Yeah, they're very similar in UVA where they have a lot of size. Um, one through five is, is they got a lot of size in those positions. So we definitely just glad we have to be prepared to to fight. You know, they they're bigger than us, but. We might have more harder. We'll see. What was the process like today? Just the suspense and having to wait till the very last uh, part of the bracket. It was nerve wracking, man. My palms were sweating. <laughs> <laughs> just looking, just waiting, and just anxious, just excited to, to see where we're gonna end up. Josh, I think you're from Wisconsin, right? Yeah, I'm from Wisconsin. That uh, add anything extra to this matchup for you? Yeah, it adds some extra because uh, in high school, I like I felt. Like I had a good high school career and I never heard from Wisconsin, never heard anything about it. So um, I definitely, definitely want to you know, go out there and show them that I that I can play against them, just because of, and with me being from the same Wisconsin, it, it, it would definitely be uh, a proud moment for my family and, and everybody back at home to be able to play against them and do well. Did you pull from them at all growing up? Were you a Badger fan, or was there any kind of connection there? I've never been a Badger fan. I've been a total opposite my whole life, really. So it's actually. <laughs> Yeah, I would pull. Yeah, I, I would pull it against them, but so it's actually it's actually exciting. It's actually a good thing you know, that I'm gonna have an opportunity to play against them. What do you take from last year, knowing how well you guys played against Virginia, knowing that you're going back into this environment, but it's it's not something you guys haven't already faced. I mean, so it's clearly a lot easier going in this year, knowing what to expect, playing where you are against another another team that's, you know, where they are. Well, yeah, it's, a, it's definitely an advantage. We uh, we know what we're getting into. We uh, we know that during the, during the game, we got to stick to our game plan and stick to the focus. And uh, last year, we didn't do that towards the second half, and and it, and it sort of helped hurt us and uh, got Virginia back in the game. So we know that we got to we got to play the whole forty minutes, and if we do that, we'll be fine. Um, I just think we're more confident this year as a team. And uh, last year, it was it was the first time and you know, coach had been in a long time, so it was more exciting just to get there. Now we got confidence as a team to get some wins in the tournament, and that's what we're really looking forward to, and that's what we that's what we're gonna try to do. So. Well, we know that Wisconsin's not a good team; they're a great team. We've seen that throughout, uh, and uh, you know, I you don't know we don't know a lot about them, but everybody knows about Kaminsky. I mean. He, if you're a basketball fan, you know they've got a great player. We've got to study their team. Uh, but Bo has, has been a friend for a long time. Uh, 
He's done a great job with his team. They're always strong, powerful, play hard-nosed defense. Uh, and, uh, you know, offensively, uh, it, when you play in any team in the Big Ten, the first thing that comes to your mind is power. Uh, so we just got to dig down and focus on getting ready for this game. Uh, we've gone extremely hard the last three days, being it's a Friday game. Uh, we'll probably give our team tomorrow off so that we can study this team and come back and get Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. That gives us six good days uh, for preparation. But, uh, you know, we got to just get information, but we're excited. Uh, you know, this is, a, as we said, a tremendous event, and uh, we're excited to be a part of it. What was your reaction to getting a 16 again? Well, I, it, it, was, it was a surprise, but, you know, it, was, it looked like it was either going to be Wisconsin or Arizona, so take your pick. <laughs> Coach, there was a lot made about you guys going to, to Portland to play. It seemed like coming down the stretch, that's what a lot of people were talking about. Now that you're not from a fan standpoint, it's easier for obviously your fan base to go to Omaha than it is in Portland. How much of a factor does that play for you, knowing that the fans have a better opportunity to come and, and cheer you guys on? Well, the closer you are, the better for your fans. That's the bottom line. Uh, but, you know, you never can predict what's going to happen on tournament selection Sunday. I mean, you just never can pr predict it. Uh, uh, so nothing nothing totally surprises me in that situation. But um, the closer you are, the easier it is for your fans. Uh, but. You know, it's going to be pretty much Big Ten territory, so to speak. So, so we know we're going into that. So we just got to dig down deep and you know, get ready and see what happens. How does your team at this point in the season compared to this point in the season a year ago, knowing you're going back to the tournament, but with a veteran team that knows what to expect, unlike this time last year? Well, I think you said it. I think that there are a lot of guys that have been there, so it's not going to be the newness of it. But I'll tell you what, the inexperienced team a year ago handled it pretty well. So these guys, that makes me feel good about the guys uh, that, that haven't been a part of the tournament uh, and uh, or haven't played much. So, you know, we we don't, again, we don't get into that. We, it's the next game. Our focus is to go in and take what we do and be the absolute best that we possibly can. They always have a really good size. Uh, how much does that concern you as a matchup problem? I haven't seen them enough yet to be to answer that question. I, I mean, I know this. We played UCLA with a lot of size. We played uh, we played teams with size, and so it's not going to be anything that we haven't seen. You know, Virginia a year ago had a lot of size, so you know we just deal with it. What was the weight like for you? You guys were right there in the end. It was antsy, but we knew we were in. I, I just didn't know whether we were going to end up, you know, in Jacksonville or, or where we are going to do it. And I, I, I had just, I thought we might be a 15 seed. I, I, my guess was we were playing Arizona. That was a guess, and I, I, it, it, didn't, it didn't happen. But, you know, like I said, it was Arizona. I was surprised we were a 16 seed, but, you know, you got to get over to play. But. You know, Wisconsin or Arizona, they're both great basketball teams. That, that's what it was getting down to. It was either going to be Arizona or Wisconsin. So, pick your poison.